A sign marking the area where the body of Emmett Till was found in Mississippi was damaged by gunfire again. Images of the sign went viral in 2016 after it was riddled with more than 40 bullet holes, and it is reportedly the fourth time the historical marker has been vandalized since it was installed in 2013. The Emmett Till Interpretive Center is planning to replace it and add additional features to tell the story of Till, who was murdered by two white men for allegedly whistling at a white woman. She later recanted her story. Till was 14 and from Chicago. Matt Yurish for CBS Chicago. The U.S. Justice Department is apparently investigating a photograph of three young men holding guns posing in front of the Emmett Till Memorial sign. Now, the picture was released today by the Mississippi Center for Investigative Reporting. According to their reporting, all three attend the University of Mississippi. Those students have apparently been suspended from Kappa Alpha fraternity. This photograph was published today on Till's birthday. Till was beaten and killed at the age of 14 near the Tallahatchie River. That was in 1955 after he was accused of whistling at a white woman. His name is closely associated with the civil rights movement. The sign near the river is full of bullets, but there's no proof that the three actually used the guns to shoot at the sign. The article says a student at the university saw the photo on a private Instagram post and made a formal bias complaint with the school. The university apparently handed the photo over to the university police, who, according to the article, then contacted the FBI. Also at Ole Miss, the Kappa Alpha Order fraternity has suspended three students over a photo which shows them posing with guns next to a civil rights marker honoring Emmett Till. Till was 14 years old when he was tortured and murdered in 1955 after being accused of whistling at a white woman. His body was dumped in the river. Now, the Mississippi Center for Investigative Reporting says one of the three students post posted the photo on social media back in March. Ole Miss says the photo is offensive and hurtful but didn't violate the university's code of conduct. The marker has a history of vandalism and it's unclear if the three people in the photo fired the, at the sign. The picture is controversial. Three smiling University of Mississippi students, two with guns, posing in front of a memorial to slain civil rights icon Emmett Till. The sign riddled with bullets. It's not clear if the students vandalized it, but for many, it's dredging up memories of a painful past. Emmett Till was 14 when he was brutally murdered by a group of white men more than 60 years ago in Mississippi. His killers went free. It is uh, not surprising, but disturbing. NBC News has not been able to identify one of the students in the photo and could not reach the other two for comment. All three were suspended from their fraternity, Kappa Alpha, which called the picture unacceptable. Ole Miss calls it offensive but says the student's actions did not violate its code of conduct. That defaced sign is now gone, soon to be replaced with a new bulletproof one. It will be the fourth Emmett Till marker to stand in this spot. The three before it were all vandalized. State Senator David Jordan was in court for Emmett Till's murder trial. What is your message to people who would deface markers like this? Stop it. Just stop it. We're better than that. From a controversial picture, an important conversation. Blaine Alexander, NBC News, Oxford, Mississippi.